why you are not progressing in life why things are not working for you that is what i want to disclose in this video and this video is very important to everyone that want to change things positively in his or her life this video will enlighten you on the things that may cause you to experience negativities so if you are not progressing in life things are not working for you this video is rightly for you by the grace of god if you can avoid what i will teach you in this video your life can never remain the same so make sure that you watch this video from the beginning to the very end to know the reasons why you are not progressing in life and what you need to do to abort that consequences but before i proceed on this video i want to tell you that you are most welcome to this channel and you are welcome in the name of the most high god as you stop to watch this video i pray that almighty god will favor you he will bless you give you success and make you to prosper in all your life endeavors this channel is for success prayers physical and spiritual well-being tips that will help you to be the best version of yourself so if today is your first time to see this channel endeavor to join this channel by hitting the like button subscribe and make sure that you turn on the bell to always get notification when next i upload a good content like this now what does it mean that someone is progressing and what does it mean that someone is not progressing progress in life is when you are capable of achieving your goal when you are capable of meeting your daily targets what you want in life the things you do on a daily basis you get what you want it is all about progress whatever you target your goal after doing things that will help you to get or to reach your goal you get it that is progress but lack of progress is when things are not working for you your target you did not meet it your goal no way to get it your business is not growing always failure disappointment obstacles it is lack of progress and what can cause this lack of progress that is what i want to share in this video the thing that makes you not to progress and if you can avoid this you will start progressing so today i want you to pay a very good attention in these threatens but under these threatens you snub these threatens that is why you are not progressing in life you reject these threatens it could be out of laziness it could be out of carelessness and it could be out of maybe the works of the enemies or evil spirits that makes you to snub these threatens and now what are the threatens these threatens are very important to take note of and in case you encounter any of these threatens you need god to avert it you need god to change things that threatens may impact in your life you need prayers that is you need prayers to tell god what you want because we will have communication we will be able to tell god what we want through prayers so you need prayers to let god know what you want him to do for you and the threatens are number one which may cause you not to progress in life or which is one of the reasons why you are not progressing is bad dreams yes when you sleep and you have a bad dream and you wake up you woke up and realize that indeed this is a bad dream and you did not do anything to stop any negative impacts you may get 
from the bad dream. You do not even pray to consult God to cancel any effects of that bad dream. Out of laziness, out of evil spirits, you snub that your bad dream. And this will make you to start experiencing negativities in life, which will make you not to progress. So anytime you have a bad dream, please endeavor to pray to cancel the effects. Endeavor to pray to make that bad dream to turn to good in your life. God is capable of everything. And with God in our lives, every good thing will be added to us. With God, all things are possible. Remember that in the scripture it says, Seek Him first, the kingdom of God. Every other thing you need shall be added. So if you have a bad dream, seek God's intervention, God's face, and that your bad dream will be averted. And during this aversion, you start progressing. You start getting what you want. You start receiving favor. You start being the best version of yourself. So do not snub bad dream whenever you encounter it to keep progressing in life. This is very important. Number two thing, you don't need to snub or reject or overlook it when you encounter it is a strange bed on your roof. Yes, that is why I put Vulture in this video thumbnail. When you see a bed like Vulture on top of your roof, it could be on top of your window, it could be anything that concerns you. And not only Vulture, it could be our, it could be bad bed that the enemy or the evil ones came with to monitor you. And this, if it repeats itself consistently, remember that the devil are at work. They want to monitor you. And during this monitoring process, you start experiencing bad luck, failure, obstacles, disappointment. So anytime you see strange bed on your roof, on your window, or at your window, remember that you need to pray to God. Chase it out. Stop that evil bed coming to you. Stop that strange bed on your roof. Because you may see it as nothing is happening. But always bear in mind that the enemies, the devils are at work. They don't want us to progress in life. But with God on our side, we will keep striving. We will keep swearing. So make sure that anytime you see strange bed, on your roof you pray over it and chase it out in case if it is a bed that the enemy or the evil ones transform themselves into to come and monitor you with prayers you destroy their evil plan you avert their evil projection and make things to keep working for you with prayers you remain in abundance you keep progressing things will keep on working for you I am saying this for you to stay alert, for you to never underrate, overlook, or snub any kind of these atrocities, any kind of these things which may come around your way. Do not snub or neglect them if you encounter any of them to remain in abundance. So anytime you see strange bread, please chase it out and pray over it. Tell God that even if the enemy came through this, they will never succeed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And as you say this prayer, keep saying it like three to four days and watch that your life will keep progressing. I mean, you will keep progressing in life. So that is it. And that is number two. Number three, which you don't need to snub or ignore whenever you encounter it is negative words from people yes out of joy out of maybe you are over happy someone may say i hate you because of this yes somebody may express his or her feelings but don't accept that he hates you that person could have evil heart 
over you. And these negative words may affect you if you accept that word. Rather, say to him or her that I reject it. I am loved by the Most High God. Even if you hate yourself, you can't hate me because I have God. Now, other negative words like stop this, you are not beautiful. Or stop this, you can't do it. Who tell you that you can't do it? Who tell you that you are not beautiful? Remember, as I am, I am totally different from everyone on this whole world. No one will be like me. The same thing is applicable to each and every one of us. And as we are unique, we have unique destiny. We have unique goal. Nobody can do what we do because you are unique. So don't let anyone deprive you your virtue. Don't let anyone to make you to have negative mind. And this negative mind will bring negative effects, negative thinking, negative subconscious mind. So never accept negative words from people. And on the other hand, if the people or the person telling you this is a friend, and that person may not have negative agenda over you, it could be from your people you don't trust. Negative people or evil people may say, don't do this, you can't do it. Out of jealousy, out of maybe you are beating them, you are to work with them. So never accept any negative words from people. If somebody tell you something that you are not comfortable with, please reject it and bless yourself with the words of your mouth. If somebody say that you can't do it, say to that person, please, I can do more than this. And with this, the universe had it. Holy Spirit had it. And God Almighty, whose every power belongs to, the creator of you, had it. And he will give you exactly what you confess because you say to him that you can do it and indeed you can do it whether you can do it or not claim it that you can do it with these positive words with written negative words from people you will keep progressing in life so these are the reasons why most people fail in life why they are not progressing so anytime you encounter these threatens, please pray to be the best version of yourself. Pray to make things to keep working for you. Pray to make you remain in abundance. So this is what I want to share with you in this video. And I strongly believe that you get value from watching this video. Please, if you never subscribe, join this channel by subscribing. Turn on the bell to get notification when next I upload a good content like this. If you have questions and comments, do not hesitate to drop it in the comment section. In fact, I will be glad to see your comments in the comment section. Let me know what you think. Like and share this video to all your friends and families. I wish you God's favor. I wish you progress. I wish you long life. I wish you protection. I wish you every good in life will offer. See you in my next video. Be blessed. Bye.